you know, I don't care who you are, you're a geek, right? Maybe you geek out about an electronic thing, or maybe you geek out about a television show. It just so happens that here in the SCA, we're all geeks about roughly the same thing. So we geek out together. Most of my friends are like, oh, that's cool. That's like LARPing, right? And I'm like, no, it's not LARPing. We want to be able to hit people with sticks, so we hit people with sticks. Uller is a, uh, a, a world-class fighter in our game. He's got uh, many other martial arts uh, credentials to his name outside of this. The most terrifying thing about him is he's not aggressive at all. He'll just sit there and just wait for you to take a swing at him, just lightly dodge it, and then smack you in the side of the head. I've been fighting in the SCA for 28 years. I found the SCA uh, actually in a comic book shop of all places, and uh, I've been doing it ever since. Becoming a knight in the society is like becoming a master of a martial art. Not only must the knight fight well, the knight must be able to teach, the knight must dress well, the knight must act like a knight. The oath that all of our knights take talks about being courteous at all times. The knight's oath goes, I here swear fealty and do homage to the crown of the Middle Kingdom to ever be a good knight and true, reverent and generous, shield of the weak, obedient to my liege lord, foremost in battle, courteous at all times, champion of the right and the good, thus swear I. My mundane life has changed a little bit because now I've actually sworn an oath. That means that everything I do every day has to follow that oath. Mundanely, I do custom woodwork, primarily carving, and I do mostly um, reproduction, medieval goods. The oath that I swore as a knight uh, tells me how to treat people and how to do business, to be courteous, to be respectful. This is a place where modern business is failing us. It's funny to me to talk about this guy because he's my buddy. We, we work in his workshop. I have a pretty good connection with Uller, so uh, I may be responsible for first spreading some of that legend, I don't know, I'll take credit. There's a legend there, uh, but he's just a guy. He's just a really good guy who was willing to share like two, three decades of SEA knowledge. So you just take here and go there. Force me into a position where I have to make this corkscrew. Big turn, come back. If I'm here, He's very good at imparting knowledge. He's very good at taking people that have done something that are worth recognition and making sure they're recognized for it. He's just one of those people you want to go have a beer with all the time. I've been doing this a long time. I've watched fighters come and go. I've seen children born to the SCA that are now adults. There's certainly a lot of family elements to it. Um, you know, you got the, the family you're born with, the family you choose. I certainly chose a lot of these folks. To go through your mundane life and you look at the calendar and go, in two weeks, I get to go live with my family. You know, I talk about the warrior ideal, and when I speak about this, I'm not teaching people how to go pick fights. That is absolutely not what I do. What we do here within our familial group is we teach people how to be better than they were yesterday. Look, we put on armor and people hit us with sticks. We don't flinch. We're still standing there. And when we're done, we take the armor off, we hug each other, and we're friends. There's the warrior ideal. In your interviews with me, you've talked about, you've asked me questions about being knighted. And I think it's different between being knighted, that's a function, that's a mechanic, and being knightly. Being knightly is what we lack in our world today. And being knightly is the thing that, in part, the society has taught me. I say thank you, I say yes ma'am, yes sir. It's how to be a gentleman, but it's more than that. It's how to act in a way that is the best for everyone around. I'm watching these common courtesies go away, and I'm very thankful that because of the society and because of who I am and what it's made me, I am knightly.